I'm Alan Horne, CEO of Broadband Pioneer, and I just moderated a session dealing with re revenue generation uh, through community-driven partnerships. And it's the challenge really is how do we connect to the unconnected with broadband communications, broadband infrastructure, and generate new revenues from those communities which are generally deemed to be uneconomic communities. And the panelists and the uh, uh, participants in this session came to some very uh, simple but firm conclusions that revenues can be generated from these communities, but what it needs is the governments, first and foremost, to set the right enabling policies, an ICT policy and a, a policy on total inclusion and e-government. That's the first and foremost. Politicians and governments need to understand the value of long-term investment in infrastructure and not short-term gains in gaining money from spectrum. The community needs to work together in a holistic approach. The community bringing together health, education and the different economic activities within the community to work together to aggregate demand. And a, f a really firm statement came over was all network operators need to really understand and work with the community, understand their needs and provide the services that those communities really need and are prepared to pay for. Funding and seed funding is required uh, generally, but that's only for a very short time if the right services are provided at the right cost. The regulator needs to create the right regulatory environments for the operators and communities to invest in their networks within those communities. So creating the right environment, working together in a holistic way was some of the key messages to actually generate new revenues and install broadband communications. Thank you.